guys and welcome to Sobe Paranormal where tonight we investigate the home of Tracy Proctor. Now this house is actually believed to be haunted by a variety of spirits. Um, she's called upon us tonight to investigate. She's lost friends, family members that refuse to come into this very building because of the stuff that's been happening. Um, so what we're going to do now is we're going to head inside, we're going to have a quick interview with the lady herself and we're going to get this investigation underway. During tonight's investigation, we have been asked to come to a conclusion on Mark Vernon's authenticity. Upon reviewing all footage captured during this investigation, we have concluded that there was no physical fakery conducted by Mark Vernon. We all look forward to working with Mark and Kyra again in the near future. While we are setting up in the living room, Mark Vernon is filming in the dining room area as he moves into the passage where you can clearly hear the door. And nothing else, just these two balls. And what then, the fuck? Again now from Mark's point of view. And nothing else, just these two balls. And what then, the fuck? And that's that. That won't me. Did you understand? <laughs> no, no, just... no, we didn't because he was so just... And then I turned my phone. Did you get that? No. Then I turned my phone off. I've actually got that on film, be it, believe it or not. I turned my phone off. Just opened the door on itself. That's all right. Was it not working? It's not been working, mate, for weeks. Are you alright with dog, yeah? Nobody do not like dogs, so you alright? No, I'm fine. <laughs> Oh, I'd love to let Missy in. That'd be a different uh, story, though. <laughs> I'll see you. I'll see you. Don't like that, say, Aaron? No, I'm fine. Oh. oh I'd love to let Missy in. That'd be a different uh, story, though. <laughs> I'll see you. I'll see you. Don't like that, say, Aaron? No, I'm fine. Oh. oh I'd love to let Missy in. That'd be a different uh, story, though. I'll see you. I'll see you. I was that warm earlier. I had to open windows, I was like stripping up and that. Mm. It's not that kind of get together. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it would have been really, really hot. Um, I think I've just filmed the girl. I hope, yeah. I hope so. Seems uh, like you. Before you came, I get. Oh, they all like you, don't they, Andy? <laughs> Hello, and welcome to Soul Reaper Paranormal. Tonight, the team have travelled to Wakefield where we're investigating the home of Tracy and Proctor. We're also here with Mark Vernon tonight. Now, can you just tell the people at home some of the things that's been happening in this home and why you believe that it's haunted? 
Um, I moved over here from Bradford and I bought this house. Gentlemen, anybody want to see a ghost? Quick. Um, I moved over here from Bradford and I bought this house. Gentlemen, anybody want to see a ghost? Quick. Um, I moved over here from Bradford and I bought this house. Gentlemen, anybody want to see a ghost? Quick. Um, I moved over here from Bradford and I bought this house. Gentlemen, anybody want to see a ghost? Quick. Sorry, I do apologise. I do apologise. <laughs> Bobby. But she came in. It, I thought I caught before you before. She, it was a very quick appearance, but she flashed above your shoulder. But then she's just come from behind back of you, and she's she's just gone up the curtains there. Caught that. You've got it on camera. Yeah, got camera. Yes. So, yeah, I told you she's yeah. making an appearance. Oh, I love. So we're gonna need that yeah. feel. Yeah, well, so yeah. we can put it. Yeah, yeah. So we can cut it into interview yeah. and show we'll why. We'll put it in like right, so I'll give you the sticker out of this. Mm -hmm. so. so we'll just crack on. Okay. So, um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm after a bad relationship. I couldn't settle anywhere. I came over here and dragged my kids over, um, and made a new life. And this is the only house I felt connected to. Has it only ever been in this house, or has it been with you in, wherever you've been? No, in the house. And this nothing. particular house. Yeah. Is there anything that was in this area, possibly that were here before the houses? Anything? Yes. Yeah. Um, what was here I, on the land? No, from... Well, under, under here was a pit where the tunnels go under the estates for miles and miles and miles. Yeah. And these right tunnels, the and these right tunnels the are they connected to the church or monks or is it the actual pit tunnels that you're on Well about? this is what I've been trying to find out. I'm not, mm -hmm. I, I don't know where the monks usually monks, comes in. Where I live in Barnsley at Montbreton there's just tunnel after tunnel. Yeah. Yeah. Where the yeah. monks used to use the secret packages. tunnels of dead bodies and that's where the, the, the buried him right through the town centre right up to Eve Common is that right? Yeah. Um, monks and everything um, I did not know anything about it. Now you said earlier on that mm -hmm. you don't feel threatened by this entity all these entities no. that could be in this home is no, that I correct? Don't. I don't. But other people do now men. Do, they, do, sorry, men. do these spirits tend to go for the men to scare them off? They physically and, and ever attacked anybody? Yeah? Hmm. Now already guys we've we've captured an amazing light anomaly upstairs in the in, in the bedroom where we've set up the CCTV. Now I think what we're gonna do here at this moment in time is we're just gonna go dark, we're gonna start calling out, no equipment, just the hmm. cameras and just listen for any noises, mm -hmm. try and get something to go off in this room. Yeah. Um the reason I mean I'm <coughs> fifty one year old and, and I sort of came at Wakefield hoping I, I couldn't sort of like meet someone and everything and I've been on dating sites and there's times where I've gone out for a coffee and a drink with a guy oh come back to mine there's, obviously there's nobody here mm -hmm. yeah uh, it's walked this particular guy walked in my house stood there he looked white he went fucking hell something here I can't stand it. Oh my fucking god! And he walked out, and he I never saw him again. Do you think these spirits are scaring men? Yeah, off from yeah, yeah. Um, it's interesting. Yeah, and the thing is, with me, I always end up with the bad guys, bad really bad, bad luck. Yeah, the you bad around. the bad guys, and they get freaked out. Um, my my last boyfriend actually came here not long ago, and he was sat here, and. He was begging me, I've made some mistakes and that, and it was during the day and I'm sat here and I was looking going, what the hell, he had beige trousers, there were blood dripping down him on his left hand, where you are now, his left hand, right, there were blood dripping down, I'm going, what you doing, what you doing, what you doing, I don't fucking know, never mind about that, I want you back and that and all that and I'm like, what the hell, I'm sat here, he's not even moved and that, he's got his fucking, like, sorry, scratched down blood all over his beige jeans and he's there begging me to come back but we fell out anyway but a few weeks after that i found out he'd been cheating and stealing and everything you know like a bad energy bad energy have you yeah. have you ever messed around with anything when you were younger i don't know it's, I don't know, um, like any <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I didn't mean that to sound as bad as what it did. I don't mean that. Well, I didn't mean that. Um, Go on, did you send a deep right, problem? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I have, have you got ever a really good story for a bit. I don't think we've got time for that. Um, 
I've had um, like a bad experience when I thought I was dying because I was in the dentist chair yeah. where I was only a young kid and I, I really believe I died and I was on this, sat on this like tunnel train, sat like this and all I could see was this light and I was travelling and travelling and all of a sudden I wanted to go to this light and then I went Phew! and I woke back. up and I woke up in the dentist chair I was screaming and screaming, like, you know, years ago they used to put you out. You won't know, you know. Yeah, I'm a dental nurse. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so years ago they used to put you... They used to put you under yeah, yeah. yeah. And I screamed and I come back and my mum and, my mom and everybody was like, oh, get her in the waiting room, what's wrong with her, blah, blah, blah. Let me go back, it was wonderful. And, oh, it was awful. You know, I come home, my mum's going mad with me, going, what happened? I was like, mum, I saw this light, I wanted to go to it, and everything. So anyway, I forgot about that. It just, that was a childhood thing. Yeah. Mark, quickly as well. Yeah. Ooh, can you explain more about this spirit or this entity that you have with you all the time? This Cara? Um, Where did you come from, do you know? Uh, I'm at Cara in a location in Wakefield. Right. called the Haunted Cellar. Right. I befriended it over a period of five years. Over five years you've been working with this spirit? Well, I sat in a cellar for five years with yeah. a light cell. Yeah. Um, put the time in and befriended her. Right. And since then she's been with me. Um, I travel around the country helping people out with paranormal right. problems. Yeah. Um, it's Cara that deals with the nasty ones. So she's working alongside you? She works alongside me and then she deals with it. Um, Are we in any danger from this, this entity? Not if she likes, you know. So is she a bad entity or a good entity? She's then? a demon. She's helping she's you. A demon. She's a demon. Alright, okay. Um, she's a Sumerian demon. Sumerian. And I believe really she ancient. attacked she. my ex who was sat there who had been cheating and going, I love no, you. Yeah. Sumeria, and he was sat Sumeria there was and had his fucking big scratch and planet. blood everywhere. All, all, all this language known on man. Yeah. But mm. I, sometimes she speaks to me in code. Yeah. See, if I go to a, an, adri an address, did you hear something? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did as well. Yeah. Anyway, um, so people can't fake stuff from me. She'll mm. speak to me in code, you know, yeah. like EVPs and stuff, so she'll speak to me in Sumerian. Yeah. I mean, I'm not fluent in it, but I can get by on yeah, it, so yeah. I understand what she's saying to me. I mean, when you've been speaking to Tracy there, I did hear her calling my name out, so yeah. that'll be on tape, that she called my name out, Mark. Right. So what we're gonna do then guys now is we're gonna have a quick short break before we start this investigation. We're gonna go dark. We're gonna start in this room, yes. we're gonna put a few K2 meters around, yes. we're gonna set up the REM pod and we're gonna get this investigation underway. Do you think it could be all to do with what you told me? She don't like the garden out there, she reckons there's something in the garden. Like the garden. Oh. I'm just having a moment oh, while Tracy gets herself composed. Yeah. What is like, I don't know what happens. Yeah. Alright, so we'll just, we'll just let Tracy get composed and then we'll start. Uh, She's just been throwing up on camera. I've never seen her do that before. Sounded awful, then. Mm. Uh. Right, Tracy. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, uh, I'm blind. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, full with it. <laughs> you look me like uh. <laughs> Right, she's here. Yeah, right. What's something you've eaten, is it? I ain't eating now. <laughs> Let's let her sit down here, man. Right, you're going to get yourself positioned. We'll not let that light up in a minute. Have you eaten that button, Bex? Yeah. Just let me Bex, there. have you eaten that button? Yeah. yeah. So what we're gonna do here, Tracy, if it's alright with you, yeah. is we're just gonna call out spirit yep. and hopefully try and get some sort yep. of reaction. Yeah. Um, whatever entities you believe are in this home, mm -hmm. we're gonna try and get some interaction. If there's any spirits in this building with us at this moment in time, I'd like to come forward and give us a sign that you may be with us in this room right now.
Is it possible for you to do something that will alert us to your presence? Would you maybe turn on the light or set off a piece of equipment? Would you maybe speak to us so we can hear your voice? What about that then? Ice? What about that then? Ice? What about that then? Ice? Cat. No. <laughs> no, I like it. Cat. No, I had. Should your camera be. Beeping. No, it's, I think it's just finished filming that one. Right. I heard, no, I heard something like glass, like, 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 like fingernails or something. I always hear stuff yeah. in the Yeah, like something been fidgeted like, with. Like, like that. Won't yeah. it? It's like, for me, we're like, like two glasses like, touching. They're like yeah. glass touching, yeah. won't it? What was that upstairs then? Yeah. yeah I heard that. Uh, I heard that. If there's any spirits upstairs that can hear my voice, please come towards it. We're all gathered in the living room. We'd like you to come into here. And do something for us to let us know that we're communicating with a spirit or an entity. That's telling next door, isn't it? Incoming EVP. If anyone else wants to call out, then just feel free to do that. Come on, stop being dickheads. We know you're there. What was that? Yeah. My stomach, man. Really <laughs> your stomach. Your stomach. We all stomach. Sounds like, like, like an old bloke, doesn't it? Yeah. Boot. Yeah. Come on. I've seen it. I've. I've witnessed it. Max. Camera. With everything. Just show us. Just. Come on, stop being dickheads. All right, we want, we're not here to harm you. That wasn't, that was upstairs. Just show us. Come on, if you love me, I love this house. I've got friends here, just tell them and show them. We're not here to hurt you. I'm here to listen. Show it. Nobody heard a woman say Sarah. No, they heard it, no. Have you ever been affecting Tracy? I've just seen something is this, flashing is this over there. Filming on here? Uh, yes. I've just seen something walk past the door. Yes. Yeah, I've just seen something flash. That's upstairs. Like, That'll be on camera then. No, I've just seen something flash like that. Anyway, I'm going to keep quiet. Um, right. Come on, um, I'm going to talk now. Um, my son, come on, my son was fucking freaked out in his mate and you walk through my house, right? How dare you tell me who you are because at the end of the day, right, my son left home because of you. I need to know what the fuck it was going on. He described you and then I didn't believe him. And then... What happened was I got in a relationship, he lived here three years and he was a skeptic, is that right? Yeah, Skep skeptic. yeah, yeah. And I he, I was there with him all the time, kept saying, Oh, this has happened, that's happened, yeah, you're fucking mental, you <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, anyway, <laughs> sorry. And oh, I, I, I tried, tried to stop swearing <laughs> because there's kids that <coughs> Sorry. And I when my daughter Right, seven, like six and a half years ago, right, mum, come and stay with me. I went to stay with her, right, until she had the baby. She had the baby, beautiful baby, and then I came back with bags. I walked through the door and he was stood there, fucking bags packed. What the hell's wrong with you? Don't you ever leave me in this house on my own. I'm like, what's wrong with you? So stuff been going off while but his baby yeah. on the house. Yeah, it... I says, come on, what's wrong with you? I says to him, any excuse, he went, 
because he didn't believe in nothing. He says, I looked up and there was a cloak figure in the doorway staring at me like a monk. I went, I laughed. I went, yeah, you will don't believe in all. Fuck you, I'm off. Boop. Never saw him again. Try not to swear. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but it makes me swear. So he who never ever, he lived here two and a half years, he who never ever believed in nothing left me because he saw something saw, wrong saw with that me. Saw something saw, wrong saw with that me. Scare. Saw something, saw something. Yes. Yes. Because you can't explain what it was, you don't. Yes. Mm, yeah, that was it. And I laughed at him. I went, "You don't believe in ghosts and that." I went, "No, I don't, but I know what I saw, and it was a cloaked figure like a bloody monk." Yeah. Someone just flash at me, uh, Becky, from up there. I don't know. Someone's just like. Someone just flashed at me. I thought he had a noise upstairs. I thought someone just took like, like, it, like it took a picture. That way, there, there, there. Oh, well, no, I didn't. From straight there. Mm. I didn't notice. Well, my cameras are off there. You two cameras off? No, that one's still filming. Look. Look. Many spirits that may be present in this house enter this living room with us right now. Do something specific. Can you move something in this room? Come on. Don't be shy, I'm not going to tell the world. Can you affect that device? I'm just going to hear the device. Incoming EVP. Break the uh, field. Oh. No, oh. no, oh. no. Show us that you're here. Mm. Kara, you're here, sweet. Kara, can you say something for me, please? You're all right, you're acting very strange. Uh, I thought that. She's, uh, your baby has changed like, her attic, has not it? No, it has. She's never been like this. You feel all right? Can we go outside for some fresh air? I'm all right. Are you sure? Yeah. Can you take a breather? Just go and go and tell. I'm fine. What's wrong with you? Is that too many weird? I'm just sat here. I'm not doing nothing. Kara, can you say hello, please? Can someone say hello? Are the children here? Can we hear the children please? The dog's focused on something. Um, me and Andy actually thought we'd heard some children, didn't we? Yeah. A couple of times, mm -hmm. just earlier on, not too long ago. Mm -hmm. then Mark said that there were kids here. Um, it's interesting. I asked if there were any neighbours either side that's got children and said no. Very odd. Mm -hmm. Who is it that's upstairs? In Tracy's bedroom. Keeps seeing you on this camera. Yeah, she's picking stuff up there from yeah. upstairs still. <coughs> can you show yourself on camera upstairs so we can see you? All we're trying to do here is document the proof of spirits, the proof of the afterlife, proof mm. of other entities. 
bit of ambulance in it. Mm. <coughs> now this camera that's set up guys, the CCTV, it's set up to record motion. That will not go off unless something's moved and detected mm -hmm. on the camera. Um, now, we're not rolling out dust because, you know, dust can get picked up. Excuse me, I'm clean. <laughs> <laughs> not. The, the, first, the, first, the first recording that we've got with that lighting on there was just spectacular one. Yeah. Mm. Oh, wow. But you said when we were up there that mm. you'd seen, a, you've got a piece of footage of an orb coming out of that doll's house. Yeah, yeah. Actually, out of the door, you know what I mean? That, that's got, about in the same area, roughly, where we'd seen this <coughs> anomaly. I have got a fantastic footage, and I've actually captured the photos of orbs, and I've opened them up. And there's things and inside them. In the orb. Lines and yeah. lines and colours. Yeah, blue. Beautiful. Yeah. And this is me sat here. Yeah. And. I could hear clicking and I thought what the hell's that noise I put lights on like that and what I did I can show you footage if Mike lets me and Did you do that bang then? Well like your foot? You bang your foot then? No I didn't I did hear it I thought it was your other no, foot No I didn't move my foot I, right. I can't move it when that's over you know. and then um, I got my camera yeah and I actually Photo, I don't know what it was, it was a white and it was a blue and it went and it exploded. Yeah, I've got it on footage. And then I'm like that looking for something because it was like clicking. And then I got two massive orbs, there were a huge one there. Mm. Two of them went and what I did, I got, I stopped it, the video, and I got, I've got uh, footage. And I showed Mark, and I opened it up. I've never seen it like it. It's like the colours and everything. We 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 got something quite interesting on this previous investigation. Mm. An orb that split in two and both went di different directions, didn't yeah. it? Yeah, I've got a white. It split. It split in half, didn't it? Right. What, what, which video is that? That's on that most recent one we've just done that the uh, school right. one, Becky. Yeah. I have similar footage and I've only yeah, ever seen it. Yeah, it just, it just broke apart. I've only ever seen that happen. But what about that? What I've got, what's white yeah. and blue and yeah. it went bang and it went Collision and energy. It's yeah. I've seen two orbs join together yeah. and then go through a room yeah. and out the front door. I've actually got footage of that. Mm. What do you believe that orbs what? are? What do you? I don't know. Physically? You tell I, me. I, I come up with. I think energy. It's the, just it's like the the vessel that they move around in me to energy. get from A to B. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't think yeah. that's. I, I think they're intelligent. I've seen a video online somewhere where a man is physically commanding orbs to go. You know, to go to different yeah. directions. Like yeah. go over there, come over there, yeah. go around there, and they do it every right. time. Yeah, I'm just. Listening there, just keep hearing things there. Yeah, it's that's a, where yeah. I can hear clicking, clicking, and that's when I got my orbs in. It sounds like glass. Right. Yeah, Kitchen. yeah. That glass, Wait. that glass is from 40s. That unit, that glass belongs in there. That's my right. great great grandmother. I'm be telling you to put it back where yeah, it belongs. Yeah. You you really, <laughs> yeah, I might could do be. actually. That's what it because, might be. Something as simple as that yeah, could be. Answered. Because I'm watching a scary movie one night, right? If you watch this, you'll fucking freak your ass out. Even Mark doesn't know it. Um, that, right? I'm watching something on my iPad and it was really creepy, like old fashioned 40s music yeah yeah and i felt some here and i turned it round to that unit there bloody hell she scared me that unit there <laughs> is a, my dead grandmother's uh, wedding present mm. that is a cocktail cabinet and you laugh because i went like that and they were dancing there were orbs coming out of it do, 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 do. <laughs> there were orbs dancing like that Never seen out like it. If you ever want to see it, let me know and I'll send it to you. Well, that's that's interesting. Have yeah. you ever got any EVPs with the little orbs where they hit the camera and then you hear the voice? Yes, we have some of them. We're audio, audible EVP where orbs have gone towards the camera mm. and then we've got yeah. a voice. Yeah, I and it's actually hit the camera. Mm. Yeah, yes. We've got one of them, haven't we? You keep looking over there, that's what I hear, I keep hearing that. I think, let's just try it, not saying anything. Yeah, just, just be totally, mm. totally quiet. <coughs> that's what I hear. Are you checking it? No, actually makes that noise. Mm. 
No, it's total silence then for five minutes, see you. That were me. Sorry. Incoming EVP. <laughs> Sorry. Nothing. Have you ever found, Mark, that when you're trying to record stuff happening that they won't do it? Yeah. And then as soon as the cameras are off, it's yep. like, well, we'll, we'll be like, oh, Definitely. Get, it, get it on. Do you know what? The things that have happened. So, I think it was all time with K2s, didn't it? We've, yeah. actually, we've actually, we believe we've had something learned how to get around devices, mm. don't we, Andy? Yeah, definitely. Um, We've been getting intense K2 activity, haven't we, for, mm. a few, for a few investigations. Mm. And Andy, we're getting good at feeling something creeping up mm. on it, you know what I mean? And every time mm. we said that, it's like, give K2, we'll give it, and it'd be yeah. going off. Yeah. Then all of a sudden, it just stopped one day. Mm. They, they, play, they played and played and played with it. They so know! The new, the they new, know! Not we gonna... think they'd figured out yeah. how, how far they could come before they exactly. set it off. Exactly. No, so what you need to do but, now... That's just a fear that we had. Yes. But it's, it's bizarre. What you need to do is just go sit in the bedroom or whatever with cameras, honestly. I don't really like it in here. And I don't know whether it's because of what she told me earlier. Right. <laughs> Why would she tell you? I'll tell you and I'll tell for camera purposes. Um, I've not told anyone else yet. But Tracy earlier said that before she moved in, there were actually a young lady, about 39 year old in her 30s, that died of cancer in this bedroom. Um, oh, I feel very choked up. <laughs> um, she uh, had a funeral and her husband didn't pay for the funeral. So when Tracy moved in, she kept getting all these letters from these funeral places, asking for payments and things. And... Um, yeah, she just had to keep sending them back saying not at this address and basically the husband had done a runner and not paid for this poor girl's funeral. Um, so yeah, but she actually died in this room apparently. So, have we got an EVP back so? No. An EVP back so? No. An EVP back so? No. The downstairs and in other, other rooms I've got one. I had to matter. I might be able to pick up one out. So I'll just do some calling out, see if camera picks anything up. We ain't got any other devices or anything in this room other than the camera that Becky's holding. Um so yeah. Is the lady that died of cancer still in this room? If you are, can you make a noise? Can you manifest yourself as a ball of light or something? Can you say something into the camera so Becky can hear it on the camera? Are you angry about what your husband did, not paying for the funeral? Are you not at peace because of that? See, I don't know whether the noises are from them downstairs or... I don't know. They sounded close though, them bangs are. Yeah, they did. But we can't rule it out that they're in. Yeah. They're not from them. Is there anything that you'd like to say to us?
Is there anybody else in this room? If anybody else is in this room, can you make yourself known by making a noise or moving something or manifesting yourself? We're not here to hurt you or harm you in any way. We're just here to try and prove that the afterlife exists. I don't know. I don't even know how to... Can you just do it again? Yeah. So for the purposes of the camera, I asked if any entities that were in this room could do anything and make themselves known. I'm hearing noises over here, but Becky's camera just completely switched off. The battery hadn't died, it just shut itself off. So we don't know whether that was just the camera malfunctioning or whether it was a spirit. But if it was a spirit, thank you for that. Can you do anything else to make yourself known? Speak to us, say something. Can you move something? Or make a noise? Yeah. Incoming EVP. It's weird, isn't it? Weird shape, isn't it? What? Somewhere I've been, I've been aiming it at there. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, I'll be filming you for a minute. You don't mind if just going to go weird? No. <laughs> <laughs> I've got an odd, I've got an odd here. So oh, I like your table there. You put your table there. I'm going to leave you there. For on your now. face, man. Hey, man. You know, we are all on your face. Yeah. Mm. Better than that's for a change. Yeah. Thing. I'm a bit man. <laughs> <laughs> this might need charging soon enough. I think I've got it. Yeah, look at this. This is, it's like reflecting off mirror, but onto. Tell me. See, see, I can't open the door. What? No, it's a uh, handle upside down. It's, it, oh, is pull it? Pull it up. Oh, right, I've not done it. I fucking Oh, we're trapped. Oh, go on, what the call? CCTV. Yeah, that one. <laughs> There's been a few next to you on bed. That's like come down and then yeah. onto the floor. Oh, at that side. side, yeah. Yeah. 
bloody hell, I've just been tricked too, mate. Bloody dog. <laughs> bedroom that we're in um just being in the first bedroom if you noticed i'm probably stealing kyle's job a little bit tonight but yeah so this is the second bedroom which is actually tracy's room um so we'll just do a little bit calling out again we've got an evp recorded there infrared camera there that becky's just moved so she can see through that camera um i've got another camera there Bex. yeah we've got yeah. marks rolling over there yeah so we've got mark's little gopro camera rolling over there so could you make yourself known if there's anybody here? Make yourself as a ball of light. Talking to an EVP recorder or talk to us. See if we can hear you with his own ears. There's an EVP recorder over there or Becky's camera might be able to pick something up. We understand that there's some children here, we've been told, that like to play with the dolls' houses. If there's anybody here, could you move something or make a noise, let us know where you are. Now, as you might be able to hear, there is a road outside and I think the windows are open. Is there any spirits here that want to tell us anything? Are you a good entity? Or are you a bad entity? Are you okay with us being here? Are you angry with anyone? Is there anything that you want us to do tonight while we're here? Earlier on I thought I heard some singing. Was that you? If that was you, could you do it again? Andy and Kyle thought they heard some children earlier. Is there any of the children here?
Yeah. Okay, two was going mad behind you. Is it? Yeah, what? Fucking hell, isn't it? That's bizarre, isn't it? Cut that go. That shouldn't be going off like that. No. And we'll we'll this just proves that this device does work. Um, and just to just top purpose of debunking, I'll put this over on here and see if it sets it up. What? Oh, different signal, different sense. Oh, that's not even going off. No, it is now. They're, they're, they're irregular, they're not even going off at the same time. So it proves that it's not a permanent signal, it's not man made. These devices are going off separately, surely they'll be going off the same, won't they? Oh, yeah. They've got a physical yeah. signal. Not, well, that's maxing this and then. Well, explain that. <laughs> what all about? There's absolutely no. no nothing there. That. Well, that's Tracy's phone, isn't it? We've already done. It's baseline checks. Everybody else's phones turned off. Mine's in my bag. No, that's turned off. There's no reason why. No, right. <coughs> Gone, what? Yeah, just go up somewhere then. Come on, that's it. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah, I mean, oh it's, it's in chair. It's in chair. There's it's still activity. There's something in chair. Keeps it's come out, out. Come, it comes out and goes back in, doesn't it? It's coming in and out of that chair, Andy. Yeah, it's going it's into chair, yeah, it's just gone back in. The flashes of light, guys, you're just seeing at home, it's just me taking photographs. But me and Mark's just witnessed the light anomaly come out of the chair and go, just made me turn around, didn't me there, didn't it? And went back in. Went back in yeah. And as you can see now, this K2 activity stopped, which is really bizarre <coughs> because we wouldn't have known that were going off until Andy actually come up and told us, would we? No. We weren't, we weren't, we weren't looking at that, we weren't busy taking photos. Back again. Well, Somebody approaches, it's kind of going off, and as we come away, it's uh, setting, setting back off again. I'm going to put another device, I'm going to put REM pod in, in Yeah, there, put REM pod in the chair. But there doesn't seem to be anything happening when it's not. Oh, because it's dead now. Nothing coming out. Yeah. If you're a spirit that's attached to that chair or you sat down in the corner, could you please affect those devices for us right now? Please try your hardest. Don't be intimidated. We're just here to prove that the afterlife is real. We're here to prove that spirits exist, that other entities exist. Thank you. See, they're getting off the same signal there. Whatever it is, quite got, got quite a bit of, bit of energy. Can you affect that other device in the middle as well? I'll show you what to do. If you just come up so to this antenna, into, into chair, then. closer you get, the more lights will come on and it'll alarm. If you touch it, <coughs> it'll make that noise. Could you possibly affect that device for us right now? Oh, something just come out, yeah. If you are a spirit, can you make that device go off in the middle, the one that alarms, the one that makes the noise? Can you break that bubble and set that off for us? Oh, biggie. Oh, a fucking biggie. That just come out of fucking... Look, came out of play in here. Yeah. That just hovered right in well, front of the team. Good thing they have, Marcus. There's an EVP yeah. recorder. So right, because that's, well, that's what's just come out of you. You did um, check for EVPs on that, and at this mark, whatever it is. I don't know if you want to check the mark or something. Because that came out of your uh, recorder, that. But it hovered right in front of the chair, and then it flew into the wall. I'm sure it came out of your recorder. Are you in this room with us right now? See, because I don't know how to put, do playback on this. If you're a friendly entity, can you set off that device in the chair? The one that I've just shown you how to do. Not those two. Try the other one if you can, please. Try that other one. Huh? Um, what about taking K2s away 
So and then making it specific, yeah. What, just them pod? Yeah. What about if I move these to this sofa and see if it yeah. them? Oh, yeah. Is it like he was all attachment to that chair? I just know there's loads of women here, but I don't know what they're doing here. There's, right. like, there's a group of them. Mm. Do you normally get activity just from one chair, or is it just every No, well, she house? had a TV, that's the first time I've seen a chair there, she had a TV there, and then she's just had a new one put up on one. Alright. So that's just been put there, that chair. Would you please set that off for us, and let us know that you're still around? If you like that cruelty fix, can you set off that device? Oh, something just went past then. Yeah. That one an orb. That was about that big. From the top hand to me. It went across there towards you. So what I'm gonna do guys, I'm gonna fire this strobe light directly at that chair. Now, we did have the K2s there and they were going absolutely insane. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to put them back because whatever was affecting them seemed to enjoy affecting them devices. So we'll put these back now, see if this signal comes back. And then what we're going to do is we're going to fire the strobe light in while we take photographs. Now, the fear behind this is what we believe is that the strobe lights, because they're actually faster than a normal camera flash, it helps illuminate the spiritual energy that they give off. Um, so that's the theory behind it, but you know we've tried it before and we had an amazing result, so we're going to try it again. Now that's going off. Just going to aim that up there like that. I'm going to take photos. Now this does approximately 10 flashes per second. Girls out upstairs. Why will I? <laughs> Sat on my <me> bed. <laughs> if you were sat in that chair a moment ago, can you try and show yourself for us, please? Can you please affect them devices like you were before? Oh, big is it? Oh, out of the chair again, or? Yeah, come out of the chair. Right, so now we're in the third bedroom, which was Tracy's daughter's room, and Tracy told us that her daughter did not like it in here at all. She says she saw a ball of light coming at her. Um, that was a flash from outside. Um, Let's <laughs> <laughs> make it a bit brighter. <laughs> Oh, I don't like dolls. Oh. But yeah, 
Um, apparently this doll kept moving in the window. Tracy had it in her bedroom window and the neighbour across the road came and asked her to take it out of the window because her son, it was scaring him. Um, apparently it kept moving positions and um, and things. Um, is there any spirits with us in this room? There is. Do you want to make yourself known to us? Make a noise. Manifest yourself as a ball of light if you can. Some dogs in distance. <laughs> oh, right. Let's go down. Are we going to light it? Right, that's all. Right, that's all. Get composed then. We'll get the spirit box and we'll try that. We were sat in that room and they were still And I was, I was sat there calling out, Becky was stood near the door just filming and camera just completely shut off. Oh, really? Didn't even, didn't even like, battery didn't go or it just shut off. After I said, is there any spirits that can do anything to show us that you're here? There's still 100 minutes left. It shut off. How long have you been doing this then? Um, what's your name again? Andrew. Oh, listen, I haven't even yeah. took you down. Nice oh, to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right. Um, well. I can't even see you under that. You like it? No, no, no. It's me, Luke. It's me, Luke. Oh. Oh, I curved almost, but that's not. You're not that, are you? No. no you look unique. You look oh, that's different. That's good. I love your tattoo. It's me, Luke. Oh. Oh, I curved almost, but that's not. You're not that, are you? No. You're not, though, are you? No. no. You look unique. You look oh, different. That's, that's good. I love your tattoo. It's me, Luke. Oh, I can't do this person. You know where I am. No, oh, you look unique, you look oh. different, that's good, I love your tattoo. Yes. Now, um, for me it's been going on all my life, to be honest. Same, yeah, so, yes, um, same, same, yeah. It's one of the meters and an archive will put it on the floor. Like all right, that. yeah. It, well, like against the, the beam. <laughs> And I'd just got set on me when my first out of uh, being here. And I'd just got set on me when my first out of And I'd just got set on me when my first out of it. Camera and I will like I hope you got that, you know, when it moves. Right guys, so we're gonna conduct this first spirit box session of tonight. Uh, basically what we're using here is a PSB7 that's been modified. We've actually got a quartz crystal inserted into that sort of PSB7 itself. Um, it's scanning in the third mode, which we call magnitude mode. Um, basically, it's an hidden mode within the PSB7. Let me get this underway. Can you tell us how many living people you can actually see in this room right now? Seven. 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 That proves that whatever we communicate with right now can see us, right? It can see us. Oh, excuse me. Not with a kid. How many people in this room are wearing hats? Please try your hardest. that's connected. 
the device. Yeah. Crystal. Crystal. Yeah. 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 Ask what? Ask what the monkey's called. Monkey's 
Here we are going to show you something. Notice the doll that Tracy has in her arms. It has a hat on its head. As Tracy sits the doll down, you can clearly see that her hands are empty. Later this video shows Tracy finding that the hat had been moved.
back to the immediate clip after she brought in the doll. As myself and Mark leave, I switched off the light and there you see Tracy grab and throw the hat behind her. Exposed as fakery. Here are a selection of more CCTV captures. Thank you for watching our videos guys, you can find us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. If you have enjoyed this video then give us a thumbs up and a like on YouTube. I'd like to thank you for having us here tonight Tracy, oh, it's been a pleasure. thank you, I really enjoyed it. You felt okay. What did you enjoy more, Spirit Box, yeah? I, think I you enjoyed, enjoyed being here and talking to you sexy men. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just a cameraman. <laughs> So Ripper Paranormal pride ourselves as being legitimate investigators. If any team or individual that we work with are found to be manipulating evidence in any way, shape or form, we will expose them as frauds. Let this be a warning to others wishing to work with us in the near future. Fakery will not be tolerated as there is far too much of this already in the paranormal field. The credibility of genuine investigators and researchers is at stake. We would urge anyone in the paranormal field to do the same and expose fakery.
in the back room and they were still and I was, I was sat there calling out Becky was stood near the door just filming and camera just completely shut off oh, really? didn't even didn't even like battery didn't go or it just shut off after I said is there any spirits that can do anything to show us that you're here there's still 100 minutes left it shut off how long have you been doing this then? Um, oh, what's well, your name again? Andy. Andrew. Oh, listen, I ain't even yeah. took it down. Nice oh, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Alright. Um, well. I can't even see you under that. You like it, I know, yeah. I know, I know. It's me look. It's me look. Oh. Oh, I could have almost better than that. You're not though, are you? No. no you look unique. You look oh, different. That's good. I love your tattoo. It's me look. Oh. oh, I could have almost better than that. You're not though, are you? No. no, you look unique, you look oh, different, that's good, I love your tattoo. Oh, I could have almost better than that. You're not though, are you? No, you look unique, you look oh, different, that's good, I love your tattoo. Oh, Cheers. Now, um, for me, it's been going on all my life, to be honest. Same, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, um, same, yeah. It's one of the meters and an archive put it on the floor. Like Alright, oh, yeah. It, or like against a, a bean. <laughs> and I've just got set on me when my first out with a bean. <laughs> and I've just got set on me when my first out with a I've just got set on me when my first out with a bean. camera and I was like, I hope you got that, you know, when it moves. Right, guys, so we're going to conduct this first spirit box session of tonight. Uh, basically, what we're using here is a PSB7 that's been modified. We've actually got a quartz crystal inserted into that actual PSB7 itself. Um, it's scanning in the third mode, which we call magnitude mode. Um, basically, it's an hidden mode within the PSB7. I'll let this underway. Can you tell us how many living people you can actually see in this room right now? Seven. 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 Whatever we're communicating with right now, can see us, right? Yeah. Can see us. Oh, excuse me. Without a kid. How many people in this room are wearing hats? Here's my put lights on like that and what I did I can show you footage if Mike lets me and Did you do that bang then? Well like your foot. Did you bang your foot then? No I didn't. I did hear it, I thought it was your other no, foot. No I didn't move my foot. I, right. I can't move it when that's over you know. And then um I got my camera yeah and I actually photo I don't know what it was it was a white and it was a blue and it went and it exploded yeah I've got it on footage and then I'm like that looking for something because it was like clicking and then I got two massive oh there were a huge one there mm. two of them went and what I did I got I stopped it the video and I got I've got a uh, footage and I showed Mark and I opened it up I've never seen it like it it's like the colours and everything. We, 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 we got something quite interesting on this previous investigation. Mm. An orb that split in two and both went di different directions, didn't yeah. it? Yeah, I've got a white it in split, it. It split in half, didn't right. it? Right. What, what, which video is that? That's on that most recent one we've just done, that the uh, school right. one, Becky. Yeah. I have similar footage and I've only yeah, ever seen it. Yeah, it just, just broke apart. I've only ever seen that happen. But what about yeah. that? What I've got, what's white yeah. and blue and yeah. it went Bang! And it went... Energy. Yeah. I've seen two orbs join together yeah. and then go through a room yeah. and out the front door. I've actually got yeah. footage of that. Mm. What do you believe that orbs what? are? What do you... I don't know, physically? you tell I, I, me. I, I come up with, I think... Energy? It's, the, just, it's like the, the vessel that they move around in me to Energy. get from A to B. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't think yeah. that's... I, I think they're intelligent. I've seen a video online somewhere where 
a man is physically commanding orbs to go, you know, to go to different yeah. directions. Like, yeah. go over there, come over there, yeah. go around there, and they do it every right. time. Yeah, I'm just listening to the orbs, keep hearing things there. Yeah, just that's where you. I can hear clicking, clicking, and that's when I got my orbs in. It just sounds like glass. Right. Yeah, yeah. That glass, Wait. that glass is from forties. That unit, that glass belongs in there. That's my right. great great grandmother. I'm telling you to put it back where yeah, it belongs. Yeah. You do, you really, yeah, I might <laughs> do actually. Yeah, that's what it because, might be. Something as simple as that yeah, could be. Answered. Because I'm watching a scary movie one night, right? If you watch this, you fucking freak your ass out. Even Mark doesn't know it. Um, that, right? I'm watching something on my iPad, and it was really creepy, like old-fashioned 40s music yeah yeah and i felt something here and i turned it round to that unit there bloody hell she scared me yeah are any of us in danger i'll talk because they're not listening to you right <laughs> in danger listen to me anybody in danger Here we are going to show you something. Notice the doll that Tracy has in her arms. It has a hat on its head. As Tracy sits the doll down, you can clearly see that her hands are empty. Later this video shows Tracy finding that the hat had been moved. Back to the immediate clip after she brought in the doll. In that chair a moment ago, can you try and show yourself for us, please? Can you please affect them devices like you were before? Out of the chair again, or? Yeah, come out of the chair. Right, so now we're in the third bedroom, which was Tracy's daughter's room, and Tracy told us that her daughter did not like it in here at all. She says she saw a ball of light coming at her. Um, that was a flash from outside. Um, Daddy, fucking <laughs> 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 fucking growling. We even said, 
also be how you are. You know how you was out like that. Just put the fucking gravel in. But you're not even with us, got here. I am not fucking <laughs> fucking turn all these off. <laughs> Let's make it a bit brighter. Where are you going? Fucking route. <laughs> fucking running upstairs, I don't know. What are we doing in here? I don't know. Looking cornered. <laughs> fucking hell, we've left it with Mark. <laughs> so we'll just do some calling out in this room, see if we can get anything. So I don't know if you want to show this back of these. <laughs> this is creeping me out. Because you see it in of my eye. Oh, I don't like dolls. Oh. But yeah, um, apparently this doll kept moving in the window. Tracy had it in her bedroom window. And the neighbour across the road came and asked her to take it out of the window because her son, it was scaring him. Um, apparently it kept moving positions and um, and things. Um, is there any spirits with us in this room? There is. Do you want to make yourself known to us? Oh. But yeah, um, apparently this doll kept moving in the window. Tracy had it in her bedroom window and the neighbour across the road came and asked her to take it out of the window because her son, it was scaring him. Um, apparently it kept moving positions and, um, and things. Um, Is there any spirits with us in this room? If there is, do you want to make yourself known to us? Make a noise. Manifest yourself as a ball of light if you can. Mm -hmm. Some dogs in distance. <laughs> Right, let's go down. Are we going to light it? Uh, let's, let's all get the compost then. We'll get the spirit box and we'll try that. We were sat, we were sat in the black room and there were still and light. I was, I was sat there calling out. Becky was standing at door just filming and camera just completely shut off. Oh, really? didn't even, didn't even like, battery didn't go or it just shut off. After I said, is there any spirits that can do anything to show us that you're here? There's still 100 minutes left. <laughs> It shut off. No. How long have you been doing this then? Um, oh, what's well, your name again? Andy. Andrew. Oh, listen, I ain't even yeah. took it down. Nice oh, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Alright. Um, well. I can't see you under that. You liked it now. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, it's me, look. It's me, look. Oh. Oh, I could have gone. That's better than that. <laughs> You're not though, are you? No. no you look unique. You look oh, that's different. That's good. I love your tattoo. It's me, look. Oh. oh, I could have gone, that's better than that. <laughs> You're not though, are you? No. no, you look unique, you look oh, different, that's good, I love your tattoo. Oh, I could have gone, that's better You're not though, are you? No, you look unique, you look oh, different, that's good, I love you.
set up in there? Nothing. Have you ever found, Mark, that when you're trying to record stuff happening that they won't do it? Yeah. And then as soon as the cameras are off, it's yep. like, well, we'll, we'll be like, oh, Definitely. Get, it, get it on. Do you know what? The things that have happened. So, yeah, they get, was yeah. all time with K2s, didn't it? We've, yeah. actually, we've actually, we believe we've had something learn how to get around devices. We've mm. done, we haven't we, Yeah, definitely. Um, We've been getting intense K2 activity, didn't we, for, mm. a, few, for a few investigations. Mm -hmm. And Andy, we're getting good at feeling something creeping up mm. on it, you know what I mean? And every time mm. we said that, it's like, give K2, give it, and it'd be yeah. going off. Yeah. Then all of a sudden, it just stopped one day. Mm. They, 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 played, they played and played and played with it. They so know! The new, the they new, know! We gonna... think they'd figured out yeah. how, how far they could come before they exactly. set it off. Exactly. No, so what, what you the, need to do that, now... That's just a fear that we have. Yes. But it's, it's bizarre. Because... What you need to do is just go sit in the bedroom or whatever with cameras, honestly. I don't really like it in here. And I don't know whether it's because of what she told me earlier. <laughs> right. <laughs> Why would she tell you? I'll tell you and I'll tell for camera purposes. Um, I've not told anyone else yet. But Tracy earlier said that before she moved in, there were actually a young lady, about a 39 year old in her 30s, that died of cancer in this bedroom. Um, oh, I feel very choked up. <laughs> um, she uh, had a funeral and her husband didn't pay for the funeral. So when Tracy moved in, she kept getting all these letters from these funeral places, asking for payments and things. And... Um, yeah, she just had to keep sending them back, saying not at this address, and basically the husband had done a runner and not paid for this poor girl's funeral. Um, so, yeah. But she actually died in this room, apparently. So, have we got an EVP back, or...? No. An EVP back, or...? No. An EVP back, or...? No. We're downstairs and in other, other rooms I've got one. I don't mind. I might be able to pick up one out. So I'll just do some calling out, see if camera picks anything up. We ain't got any... Talk to me! Yay! 
Here we are going to show you something. Notice the doll that Tracy has in her arms. It has a hat on its head. As Tracy sits the doll down, you can clearly see that her hands are empty. To scare them off. Have they physically any, ever attacked anybody? Yeah? Mm. Now already guys, we've, we've captured an amazing light anomaly upstairs in the, in, in the bedroom where we've set up the CCTV. Now, I think what we're going to do here at this moment in time is we're just going to go dark, we're going to start calling out, no equipment, just the mm. cameras and just listen for any noises, mm -hmm. try and get something to go off in this room. Yeah. Um, the reason, I mean I'm 51 <coughs> year old and, and I sort of came at Wakefield hoping I, I couldn't sort of like meet someone and everything and I've been on dating sites and there's times where I've gone out for a coffee and a drink with a guy oh come back to mine, there's, obviously there's nobody here mm -hmm. yeah, uh, it's walked, this particular guy walked in my house stood there, he looked white, he went fucking hell, something here I can't stand it. Oh my fucking god! And he walked out, and he I never saw him again. Do you think these spirits are scaring men? Yeah, off from yeah, yeah. Um, it's interesting. Yeah, and the thing is, with me, I always end up with the bad guys, bad really bad, bad luck. Yeah, the you bad around. the bad guys, and they get freaked out. Um, my my last boyfriend actually came here not long ago, and he was sat here, and. He was begging me, I've made some mistakes and that, and it was during the day and I'm sat here and I was looking going, what the hell, he had beige trousers, there were blood dripping down him on his left hand, where you are now, his left hand, right, there were blood dripping down, I'm going, what you doing, what you doing, what you doing, I don't fucking know, never mind about that, I want you back and that and all that and I'm like, what the hell, I'm sat here, he's not even moved and that, he's got his fucking, like, sorry, scratched down, blood all over his beige jeans and he's there begging me to come back but we fell out anyway but a few weeks after that I found out he'd been cheating and stealing and everything you know, like a bad energy Bad energy, have you, yeah. have you ever messed around with anything when you were younger? Yeah, I know it's, I don't um, know, like any paranormal <laughs> stuff Excuse me! <laughs> I didn't mean that to sound as bad as what it did I mean that. Well, I mean that. Um, Go on, dig in a deep hole. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I have, have you got ever a really with... good story for a bit. I don't think we've got time for that. Um, I've had um, like a bad experience when I thought I was dying because I was in the dentist chair yeah. where I was only a young kid and I, I really believe I died. And I were on this, sat on this like tunnel train, sat like this, and all I could see was this light. And I was travelling and travelling, and all of a sudden I wanted to go to this light. And then I went, whoo! And I woke back. up, and I woke up in the dentist chair, I was screaming and <laughs> screaming. So we'll just do some calling out in this room, see if we can get anything. I don't know if you want to show this picky for these. <laughs> this is creeping me out. Because you see it in of my eye. Oh, I don't like dolls. Oh. But yeah. Um, apparently this doll kept moving in the window. Tracy had it in her bedroom window. And the neighbour across the road came and asked her to take it out of the window because her son, it was scaring him. Um, apparently it kept moving positions and... Um, and things um is there any spirits with us in this room if there is do you want to make yourself known to us Noise. Manifest yourself as a ball of light if you can.
have some dogs in distance. <laughs> Let's go down. Are we going to light? Oh, that's all. That's all. Get compost then. We'll get the spirit box and we'll try that. We were, sat, we were sat in the back room and there were still and I was, I was sat there calling out Becky was stood near the door just filming and camera just completely shut off oh, really? didn't even didn't even like battery didn't go or it just shut off after I said is there any spirits that can do anything to show us that you're here there's still 100 minutes left <laughs> it shut off no I mean. how long have you been doing this then oh, what's well, your name again Andy. Andrew. Oh, listen, I haven't even yeah. took you down. Nice no, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Alright. Um, well. Okay, I can see you under that. You like it? Oh, no, no, no. It's me look. It's me look. Oh. Oh, I curve almost better than that. <laughs> You're not that, are you? No. No, you look unique. You look oh, different. That's good. I love your tattoo. It's me look. Oh. Oh, I curve. <laughs> purpose of debunking, I'll put this over here and see if it sets it up. What? Oh, different signal, different sense. Oh, that's never going off. There it is now. They're, they're, they're irregular, they're not even going off at the same time. So it proves that it's not a permanent signal, it's not man-made. These devices are going off separately, surely they'll be going off the same, won't they? Yeah. So got a physical yeah. signal. And they're just not. Well, 
That's Max in this and that. Well, I'll explain that. <laughs> what about? There's absolutely no, no nothing there. On that. Well, that's Tracy's phone, isn't it? We've already done. His baseline checks. Everybody else's phones are turned off. Mine's in my bag. Well, that's There's no reason why. Gone, what? Yeah, just go somewhere then. Come well, on, come that's it. Well, get oh, out of fucking hell. Yeah, I mean, oh, it's in chair. It's in chair. There's it's still activity. There's something in chair. It's come out, come out, it comes out and goes back in, doesn't it? It's coming in and out of that chair, and it? Yeah, it's going into the chair, yeah, it's just gone back in. The flashes of light, guys, you've just seen at home, it's just me taking photographs. But me and Mark's just witnessed the light anomaly come out of the chair and go, just made me turn around in my dad, didn't it? And went back in. Went back in yeah. And as you can see now, this K2 activity stopped, which is really bizarre <coughs> because we wouldn't have known that was going off until Andy actually come up and told us, would we? No. We weren't, we weren't, we weren't looking we're at that, watching. we were busy taking photos. Back again. Oh. Somebody approaches, it's kind of going off, and as we come away, it's uh, setting, setting back off again. I'm going to put another device, I'm going to put Rempod in. in yeah, the put Rempod in chair. There don't seem to be anything happening when it's not. Oh, because it's dead now. Nothing coming out. Yeah. If you're a spirit that's attached to that chair or you sat down in the corner, could you please affect those devices for us right now? Please try your hardest. Don't be intimidated. We're just here to prove that the afterlife is real. We're here to prove that spirits exist, that other entities exist. Thank you. See, they're getting off the same signal there. Whatever it is, quite got, got quite a bit of bit of energy. Can you affect that other device in the middle as well? I'll show you what to do. If you just come up so to the antenna, into it, chair. Then. Closer you get, the more lights will come on, and it'll alarm. If you touch it, <coughs> it'll make that noise. Could you? Right, who's the spirit who looks after me? No. Who's the spirit who looks after me at home? Here we are going to show you something. Notice the doll that Tracy has in her arms. It has a hat on its head. As Tracy sits the doll down, you can clearly see that her hands are empty. Later this video shows Tracy finding that the hat had been moved. Back to the immediate clip after she brought in the doll, as myself and Mark leave. I switched off the light and there you see Tracy grab and throw the hat behind her. Exposed as fakery. Here are a selection of more CCTV captures.
We're just having a moment oh, while Tracy so gets herself composed. Yeah. Just like, Alright, so we'll just we'll just let Tracy get composed and then we'll start. Uh, She's just been throwing up on camera. I've never seen her do that before. It sounded awful, didn't it? Mm. Uh. Alright, Tracy. <laughs> I'm blind. I'm like full with it. You look me like a girl. Right, she's here. Yeah, right. That's something you're eating, is it? I'm eating it. Let's let her sit down here, man. Right, you're going to get yourself positioned. We'll not let that light up in a minute. Have you eaten that button, Bex? Yeah. Just let me Bex, there. have you eaten that button? Oh, yeah. Where's my fucking bag gone? So, what we're going to do here, Tracy, if it's alright with you, yeah. is we're just going to call out spirit. Yep, you know, do to whatever. try and get some sort yep. of reaction yeah. um, whatever entities you believe are in this home mm -hmm. we're going to try and get some interaction if there's any spirits in this building with us at this moment in time I'd like to come forward and give us a sign that you may be with us in this room right now Is it possible for you to do something that will alert us to your presence? Would you maybe turn on a light or set off a piece of equipment? Would you maybe speak to us so we can hear your voice? What about that then? Voice? What about that then? Voice? Should your camera be beeping? No, it's, I think it's just finished filming that one. Right. I heard, no, I heard something like glass, like, 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 like fingernails or something. I always hear stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, like something I've been fidgeted like, with. Like, like that. Why yeah. not? It's like, like two glasses touching. Yeah, like glass yeah. touching, yeah. why not? What that upstairs then? Yeah. Yeah, I heard that. I heard that. If there's any spirits upstairs that can hear my voice, please come towards it. We're all gathered in the living room. We'd like you to come into here and do something for us to let us know that we're communicating with a spirit or an entity. Telling next door, isn't it? Incoming EV. Let's go down. Are we going to light it? Uh, let's all get composed then. We'll get the spirit box and we'll try that. We were sat, we were sat in the back room and there were still and I was, I was sat there calling out. Becky was stood near the door just filming and camera just completely shut off. Oh, really? didn't even, didn't even, like, battery didn't go or it just shut off. After I said, is there any spirits that can do anything to show us that you're here? There's still 100 minutes left. <laughs> It shut off. No. How long have you been doing this then? Um, oh, what's well, your name again? Andy. Andrew. Oh, listen, I ain't even yeah. took it down. Nice oh, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Alright. Um, well. I can't see you under that. You liked it now. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, Andy. It's me, look. It's me, look. Oh. Oh, I could have gone. That's better than that. <laughs> You're not that, are you? No. no, you look unique. You look oh, different. That's good. I love your tattoo. It's me, look. Oh. oh, I could have gone, that's better than that. <laughs> you're not though, are you? No. no, you look unique, you look oh, different, that's good, I love your tattoo. Oh, I could have gone, that's better than that. You're not though, are you? No, you look unique, you look oh, different, that's good, I love your tattoo. Oh, Cheers. Now, um, for me, it's been going on all my life, to be honest. Same, yeah, so, yeah, um, yeah, same, yeah. 
It's one of my meters and an archival put it on the floor. Like All that. right, yeah. It, or like against a, a bean. <laughs> And I'd just got set on me when my first out of being there. And I'd just got set on me when my first out of being there. And I'd just got set on me when my first out of being there. And I'd just got set on me when my first out of got that, you know, when it moves. Right, guys, so we're going to conduct this first spirit box session of tonight. Uh, basically, what we're using here is a PSB7 that's been modified. We've actually got a quartz crystal inserted into that sort of PSB7 itself. Um, it's scanning in the third mode, which we call magnitude mode. Um, basically, it's an hidden mode within the PSB7. I'll let this underwear. Can you tell us how many living people you can actually see in this room right now? Yeah. Okay. Seven. Seven. Yeah, man. Seven. 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 Right now, room where we've set up the CCTV. Now, I think what we're going to do here at this moment in time is we're just going to go dark, we're going to start calling out, no equipment, just the mm -hmm. cameras, and just listen for any noises, mm -hmm. try and get something to go off in this room. And yeah. um, the reason, I mean, I'm 51 <coughs> year old, and, and I sort of came at Wakefield hoping I, I couldn't sort of like meet someone and everything, and I've been on dating sites. And there's times where I've gone out for a coffee and a drink with a guy. Oh, come back to mine. There's, obviously, there's nobody here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, it's walked, this particular guy walked in my house, stood there. He looked white. He went, fucking hell. Something here. I can't stand it. Oh my fucking god. And he walked out and he, I never saw him again. You don't think these spirits are scaring men? Yeah. Off from yeah. Yeah. Um, it's interesting. Yeah, and the thing is with me, I always end up with the bad guys, bad really bad, bad luck yeah, following the you bad, around. The bad guys, and they get freaked out. Um, my my last boyfriend actually came here not long ago, and he was sat here, and he was begging me. I've made some mistakes and that, and it was during the day, and I'm sat here, and. I was looking going, what the hell, he had beige trousers, there were blood dripping down him on his left hand, where you are now, his left hand, right, there were blood dripping down, I'm going, what you doing, what you doing, what you doing, I don't fucking know, never mind about that, I want you back and that and all that, and I'm like, what the hell, I'm sat here, he's not even moved and that, he's got his fucking, like, sorry, <laughs> scratch down, blood all over his beige jeans, and he's there begging me to come back, but... We fell out anyway, but a few weeks after that, I found out he'd been cheating and stealing and everything. You know, it was like a bad energy. Bad energy. Have you yeah. have you ever messed around with anything when you were younger? Yeah, I don't know. It's, I don't know um, like, like any paranormal <laughs> stuff. Excuse me. <laughs> I didn't mean that to sound as bad as what it did. I mean it that. Well, I mean it that. Um, Go on, dig it in a deeper right, hole. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. <laughs> I have, have you got ever played a really good story for a bit. I, I don't think, think we've got time for that. Um, I've had um, like a bad experience when I thought I was dying because I was in the dentist chair yeah. where I was only a young kid, and I, I really believe I died. And I were on this, sat on this like tunnel train, sat like this, and all I could see was this light. And I was travelling and travelling and all of a sudden I wanted to go to this light. And then I went, whoo, and I woke back. up. And I woke up in the dentist chair. I was screaming and screaming. Right, you know, years ago they used to put you out. You won't know, you know. Yeah, I'm a dental nurse. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so years ago. Uh, could you please affect those devices for us right now? Please try your hardest. Don't be intimidated. We're just here to prove that the afterlife is real. We're here to prove that spirits exist, that other entities exist. Thank you. See, they're getting off the same signal there. Whatever it is, quite got, got quite a bit of, bit of energy. Can you affect that other device in the middle as well? I'll show you what to do. If you just come up so to this antenna, into, into the antennae, closer you get. The more lights will come on and it'll alarm. If you touch it, <coughs> it'll make that noise. Could you possibly affect that device for us right now? I hope someone just come out to you. If you are a spirit, can you make that device go off 
in the middle, the one that alarms, the one that makes the noise. Can you break that bubble and set that off for us. Oh, biggie. Oh, a fucking biggie. That just come out of fucking. It came out of play, here. Yeah. That just hovered right in well, front of the tea. Good thing there, Marcus. There's an EVP yeah. recorder. Right, because that's, well, that's what's just come out of you. You did um, check for EVPs on that, and at this mark, whatever it is. I don't know if you want to check the mark or something, because that came out of your uh, recorder, what? that. But it hovered right in front of the chair, and then it flew into it well. I'm sure it came out of your recorder. Are you in this room with us right now? See, because I don't know how to put, do playback on this. If you're a friendly entity, can you set off that device in the chair? The one that I've just shown you how to do. Not those two. Try the other one if you can, please. I'll try the other one. Huh? Um, what about taking K2s away? See, just leave and it then making pod. it specific, yeah. What, just them pod? Yeah. What about if I move these to this sofa and see if it yeah. follows them? Oh, yeah. You like usual attachment to that chair? I just know there's loads of women here, but I don't know what they're doing here. There's, right. like, there's a group of them. Do you normally get activity just from one chair or is it just every No, well, she had a TV, that's the first time I've seen a chair there, she had a TV there, and then she's just a new one put up on one. Alright. So that's just been put there, that chair. Would you please? Yeah. Blue. Beautiful. Yeah. And this is me sat here, yeah, and I could hear clicking, and I thought, what the hell's that noise? I put lights on, like that. And what I did, I can show you the footage if Mike lets me. And Was it that bang then? Was that your foot? Did you bang your foot then? No, I didn't. I did hear it, I thought it was your other no, foot. No, I didn't move my foot. I, right. I can't move it when that's over. You know. And then, um, I got my camera, yeah, and I actually photo, I don't know what it was, it was a white and it was a blue and it went and it exploded. Yeah, I've got it on footage. And then I'm like that looking for something because it was like clicking. And then I got two massive oh, there were a huge one there. Mm. Two of them went and what I did, I got I stopped it, the video, and I got I've got uh footage and I showed Mark and I opened it up. I've never seen it like it. It's like the colours and everything. We, 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 we got something quite interesting on this previous investigation. Mm. An orb that split in two and both went di different directions, didn't yeah. it? Yeah, I've got a white it split, in it. It split in half, didn't it? Right. What, what, which video is that? That's on that most recent one we've just done, that the uh, school right. order, Becky. Yeah. I have similar footage and I've only yeah, ever seen it. Yeah, it, it just, it just broke apart. I've only ever seen that happen. But what about that What I've got? What's white yeah. and blue and yeah. it went Bang! And it went. Energy. Yeah. I've seen two orbs join together yeah. and then go through a room yeah. and out the front door. I've actually got yeah. footage of that. Mm. What do you believe that orbs what? are? What do you. I don't know, physically? you tell I, me. I, I, I come up with, I think. Energy? It's, the, just, it's like the, the vessel that they move around in me to Energy. get from A to B. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't think yeah. that's. I, I think they're intelligent. I've seen a video online somewhere where a man. Is physically commanding orbs to go, you know, to go to different yeah. directions. Like yeah. go over there, come over there, yeah. go around there, and they're doing it every right. time. Yeah, I'm just listening there. Just keep hearing things there. Yeah, it's that's a, where yeah. I can hear clicking, clicking, and that's when I got my orbs in. It sounds like glass. Right. Yeah, Kitchen. yeah. That glass, Wait. that glass is from forties. That unit, that glass belongs in there. That's my right. great great grandmother. I'm telling you to put it back where yeah, it belongs. Yeah. <laughs> do, you really, yeah, I might <laughs> do actually. That's what it because, might be. Something as simple as that yeah, could be. Answered. Because I'm watching a scary movie one night, right? If you watch this, you'll fucking freak your ass out. Even Mark doesn't know it. Um, that 
right i was watching something on my ipad and it was really creepy like old-fashioned 40s music yeah 